guys. Happy Thanksgiving week. Actually, when you'll see this, um, it'll be past Thanksgiving. So I hope you had a great Thanksgiving. It is currently Monday. I'm leaving to Oregon on Wednesday. But I'm just working today, but I think I want to either get matcha or coffee. So we're going to go. I ended up getting Starbucks because Luke invited me to go watch football or soccer <laughs> with him. Uh, so I'm going to go over and watch the game with him. But I really want a blue bottle, but it was a little bit too much of a hassle to go and park and do the whole thing. So got Starbucks. I would just like to say... A caramel brulee latte is like the most superior Starbucks drink. I honestly don't, I haven't been in like a big Starbucks grind as I once was in high school and stuff, but the holiday drinks I will come around for. I'm kind of silly because all I had this morning was a Starbucks breakfast sandwich. I hate the days when I just like don't eat because I have such low energy. I don't want to do anything in the evening. I'm grumpy. I'm just in a bad mood. So I'm gonna make a smoothie and put some protein powder in it and then hopefully we'll have a better evening and I wanna work out and I wanna read. So we're gonna try and make that happen. Also, this little Kosas pack, I'm gonna open it up because I'm gonna try it. The way I'm sitting right now makes me feel like I'm like going to therapy. Okay, I think I'm gonna open up, um... this one looks so pinky. I don't know, which one should I try? I'll try this one. Okay, <laughs> why is everything just coming out of my hands? <laughs> Ooh, look how pretty this is. Well, that's what it looks like. Oh, this is called Costa Sport, so the shade of Rush. What about this packaging? Like, this is such a weird shape. <gasps> that's pretty. I like that. That's so natural looking. Ow, I have a cold sore on my uh, side. I also have a breakout. So the combination of both isn't the best. Let's go make a smoothie. So pink. And fun fact about me, I love straws. I use a straw all the time. So we're pretty sunset. Maybe we'll go to the rooftop. Wow, that tastes very banana-y. Bananas are so overbearing, it's crazy. We're gonna go to the rooftop and see if we can watch the sunset. Out, but there's a pretty sunset and all the birds are flying right over me oh my goodness this is crazy there's so many they just keep coming oh my gosh okay it's like the perfect temperature right now and honestly recently i've been kind of complaining because i'm like i miss <laughs> i miss oregon i miss the cold but i like walked outside yesterday and i was like wow it's so warm outside it feels like i just lived through a whole winter all to say i am very excited to go to oregon this week and experience some actual coldness my camera died during sunset. I follow a bunch of like movie recommendation accounts. So they're just people who are recommending good movies. And I saw one that popped up. No, I really want to watch the movie. It's called The Voyeurs. It's with Sydney Sweeney. I have any dinner. I kind of want to do a little workout or something. Just like, just, just to get my heart rate going at least. Then I'm going to watch this movie. I'll watch it while I'm doing my workout. That's not like me. Like working out in a box. I have to be present on working out. Like, you don't always have to do that, you know? Working out regardless is good for your health, you know? Just get your heart rate going. I can get my heart rate going while watching a movie. That's gonna be okay. I'll work out and I'll check in with you guys about how this movie is going. Who am I to receive PR from Prada? I'm like absolutely nobody, but you know what? I am honored. I just unboxed her per the uh, mess right here, but it's very beautiful. It smells kind of like fresh spring. Honestly, kind of has like a grandma smell to it, but in a really good way. <laughs> also, the refill is really cool. Let me show you guys. Basically, you just take this off and like take the cap off and then it just goes in like that. I'm so innovative. Love that. But thank you, Prada. So nice of you. I leave tomorrow to Oregon, but I kind of want to uh, put my hair. Oh my gosh. I just brushed my hair. Look how poofy it is. It's scary. I kind of want to do some self-care. So I want to dermaplane and do a teeth whitening strips situation and then and then eye masks i honestly just might wear the eye masks on the plane tomorrow we'll see but i have about 30 minutes to do this because then i have to go jump my boyfriend's car with him <laughs> so we're gonna do it together i did a really bad job with my makeup today it looks very orange my forehead looks very orange i'm really excited to go home my uh, home life and situation the other dynamic has changed a lot over the past like two years in a very positive way. Um, so it makes it a lot more enjoyable to actually go home and spend time with people, so.
Gonna use this uh, Kinship Oh Ceramide Relief Oil to dermaplane with, and then I use this Jill Razor. When I use it, I wash it with alcohol. Okay, I submerge my face in this basically. I take the razor, and you always want to do it down and not like up. I also want to avoid breakouts. So like I have this breakout and this breakout, so I won't be going around there. Put the moisturizer on, and there's only one moisturizer my skin can handle when it's sensitive like this. Like I have super, super sensitive skin. And it's the Dr. Jar Ceramidin Cream. Any other moisturizer makes it just sting a little bit. But this is like the only one that ever just doesn't make it sting or feel irritated at all. And I think it's just because a lot of other products have a little bit of fragrance in it. But this one, does it? I don't, I don't think it does at all. Works wonders, I need to buy a bigger one because this is just like came in the holiday kit. It's kind of like this thicky butter texture. Honestly, butter is like the best way to describe it. <laughs> Look how it came out. I've never seen it come out like that. Put the Laneige lip mask on again. Uh, we still have 20 minutes left before I have to leave. I put teeth whitening strips on. I usually use these Luminex ones because my teeth are very sensitive, but I do think the Crest ones last longer. So I'm gonna use these and I've also had these for so long. I don't know if they expire. We're gonna pack together when I get back from jump starting Luke's car with them. It's just stuck in a parking lot right now. Car has been jumped. It was a whole process. It was actually so crazy, you guys. <laughs> My boyfriend's car died at a Ralph's parking lot. So a grocery store parking lot. When your car dies, you wanna jump it, you have to have the cars facing each other forward. So like Luke was like parked at a spot, but there's like bushes there. And then there's a parking spot in front of it, thankfully. But he parked at the front of the store and it's literally like two days before Thanksgiving. So it is like peak grocery store time, especially at literally 4.30 PM. So we get there and there's just cars going in and out, in and out, in and out. And so I was like, Luke, I think we're gonna have to like ask somebody as we're pulling into that spot if we can just take it really fast. Like we need to get your car out of here. So he hops out of the car and goes and asks this lady and literally stands at like a 30 feet distance because he doesn't want to be scary. And he's like, hey, like, excuse me, ma'am. Like, is there any chance? And she goes, oh, like, who, what do you want? What do you, who, who are you? What do you want? What do you want? And looks like, oh, like, that's my car. Like, I just died. Like, I was hoping my girlfriend could park here so we can jump in. She's like, I can seal. I can seal. Like, and then like locked her doors, rolled her window up and then like rolled her other window down and started telling him how like, how she had a hip replacement recently. She needs to park in the front. And he was like, okay, like we can wait for you to get out. That's okay. And then she's like, no, 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 you need to jump your car. And then like drove around, was waiting for us to leave, like drove into like waited for us to jump the car. And his car was not starting. It was just chaos. And then it took a long time for the car to jump because turns out I have some, I don't know, corrosion. I don't know what that means on my battery. Long story short, we got it to work. And now I'm um, gonna pack and I am so incredibly hungry. I need to eat something. I'm gonna pack and then eat. Clock. I'm almost done packing. Okay. See you guys in Oregon. I've made it to Oregon. It is cold and it feels nice. I've missed the cold. <laughs> so happy to be wearing like Oregon clothes. Wearing a beanie. I got this in South Africa. Jean jacket. Leggings. Uggs. And I'm gonna go get a hot coffee too. I'm so excited. <laughs> We're going bowling. There's always lipstick in my teeth. I did my hair. Hi, girlies. Hi, girlies. Hi. What is on your nose? Hi, baby girls. You guys have a good night. You guys have a good night. We go bowling, get pizza, then go to bed. Happy Thanksgiving. Going over to my cousin Kinsey's house. If you guys remember her, I went to Disneyland with her. Very excited. I love Thanksgiving. Honestly, I think it's one of my favorite holidays because it's just like when all my family comes together. Oh, shit, scarf is suffocating me. Also, I learned this turtleneck hack where you tuck the shoulder neck in instead of out, which changed my life. But I'm happy with my uh, hair and makeup though. We're eating uh, at three o'clock. I don't know what time you guys usually normally eat up, but that's what we're doing. So hope you guys have had a lovely Thanksgiving and I'm gonna go spend time with my family, so. We're gonna go get breakfast. I kind of feel like crap though, but it's okay. Um, we went to the store yesterday to get medicine. It was so picked over. Got some day cool, night cool eventually. They also, <laughs> Luke and I were set up. We went to the store without our IDs. And so we couldn't even get it because you have to be 18 and they check your ID to get Nigel. We can get breakfast and then we're gonna have a busy day. Lots to do, but it'll be fun. And then only a few days left. So 